what's up what it do Sabawa? it is your girl the one the only ash said it ash said it.com ash said it.com baby babies okay so tomorrow is atlanta wine party and yes crazy will be in Tilden. i will be there not sure what time because i've got two previous engagements that i have to have to have to be at but i will definitely be passing through the atlanta wine party if you guys have if you're in the metro Atlanta area and you have not experienced a variation of like, I don't know, like 50 something different wines, of course I'm not drinking or tasting all 50 because I'm there on assignment obviously, but um, it's, a, it's an awesome, it's an awesome fun time, so if you ever get a chance to go, definitely go out, it's definitely worth it. It's worth the money. Yes, it is worth the cool kings, darling. And I believe they may have a couple of last-minute tickets. I saw on the Facebook. On the Facebook. It's like an old person. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sorry. I saw on the Facebook. There was a couple people selling their VIP tickets. I guess something came up. They're not able to go. So they're selling their VIP tickets, which was like, I don't know, like $80 worth of... Uh, and they're like $8 and they're selling them for like 50 bucks. So if you're in the Metro Atlanta area and you want to jump into the party, you need to jump onto it like uh, right now. All right. So there is a Facebook event entitled for Atlanta Wine Party and you need to make sure that your butt is there because it's going to be so much fun. It's going to be so much fun. I'm sorry if I'm sniffling on you guys. Still kind of getting over that whole sinus infection situation thing and I'm still gonna be in the building so like I said I gotta make up for last weekend last weekend I couldn't do really much of anything which really sucked <laughs> that was not how I wanted to end my weekend that's not how I wanted to spend my weekend but we make do with what we get you know we do the best that we can and then we forget the rest basically that's all that we can do so kind of somewhat making up for last week and this weekend in a way. Shout out to my brother from another mother, Dragon Music Sunday. This Sunday at the Coconut Grill in Duluth. Y'all need to come out and celebrate with us. It's going to be so much fun. Come and celebrate with Dre as we celebrate the Rum Punch Brunch. All right, they moved it. This is the new location of the Rum Punch Brunch. We had to move it because getting too crowded and crazy and all kind of just randomness was happening so we had to move the rum punch brunch and it is moved to the coconut grill out there in Duluth. so i have to slip through that too i'm not sure when i'm going to slip on through and give my brother some love and support because we support each other we support the movement i'm gonna tell you a little bit about drag y'all go check out dragay.com is that the hell i said it's like reggae with a d up front Alright, Dre.com. Dre and I actually attended high school together. We're in the same class, hung around the same people, and never really got, never really met. I don't know, we could have met once or twice, and it just never was past like a high and by situation. I don't know what it is, because I don't understand how we had the same group of friends and we never connected. So, years and years later, when he's doing the music thing, and I started my podcast live with Ash Beasy. He was one of the key people that I hit up because everybody kept sending me his music and sending me his music. Oh, you gotta check out this guy. He's got this track called Sex Education. So, you know, it's crazy, it's raw, it's brand new. You gotta hear this stuff, Ash. And I just really loved his 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 style. His style, his swagger. And when I got him on the podcast, we got to start to talking about everything and you know, schools and everything, and then it came up, oh snap. We went to the same high school. Are you serious? Graduated the same year. OMG. <laughs> so from that, he's just really been a supporter of the movement, which is he's watched Ash evolve. I've watched Dre and Dregay evolve. You know, we used to call him Dre Money, the money man. <laughs> but now he is simply Dregay. So Dre, I love you, brother. I support you. I appreciate you so very much. And we're going to continue to push the thing. We're going to push it forward. So if you like Caribbean food, you're in the metro Atlanta area, you need to make sure that you're at the Coconut Grill 
I want to say it starts at noon, maybe noon till five. That's like a brunch, right? Noon till five, something like that. I'm probably giving out horrible times, but go and check out dragamusic.com because I'm sure that the flyer is up there with the exact time of when the rum punch, I can't talk, rum punch brunch starts. That's a tongue twister. Rum punch brunch, rum punch brunch, rum punch brunch. Yeah, so you can get more information on when it actually starts. Location wise, you can get the address of the coconut grill and you'll see us out there as we enjoy, you know, Aki and Sawfish and Kalalu and all them great things. Yeah, it's gonna be a great menu, so I'm looking forward to it. But, um, that's pretty much the story with that. So, what else is going over? Sonesta, shout out to Sonesta. Sonesta put me up last week and I had a blast over there. OMG, I had so much fun. I am trying to figure out ways of getting back over there. <sighs> I had an exceptional experience. If you want to hear more about my experience, go to ashley.com, go to the blog, and you can read all about my experience at Sonesta Gwinnett Place, Atlanta. Yeah, so a lot of happen there. We can go into that a little bit more into depth. Shout out to Massage Heights, Massage Heights Johns Creek treated me like a queen. I felt like royal to you guys. Oh, um, gee, I've never had such a good massage ever. No one's ever given me that awesome of a massage. So, I love them. They are the new love of my life. <laughs> and I'm gonna have to figure out how to get some more of that love in my life. I gotta figure it out. I don't know how, but it's just, it's coming to be. It, it has to. There's no way around it. I'm going to have to work that out. I don't know how, but I'm going to have to do something. Going to have to do something. So, that pretty much is the story with that, of course, darling. Yes, darling. Yes. What else is going on this weekend? There's so much stuff going on this weekend. Explore. Atlanta Explorer. <coughs> Excuse me. Atlanta Explorer. If you want to find out what's going on in the city, which is... So much stuff. There's so many things going on in the city. Melting Pot Atlanta. They've got four Metro Atlanta locations. Endless Fondue. You can't beat that. It's good stuff. Why? I know because I went and had me some Endless Fondue. It was good stuff. Good, good stuff. Um, Atlanta Explorer. Go and download the app Atlanta Explorer right now. Be sure to put that up and get that set up because... It will tell you all of what's going on in Atlanta this weekend. And always. I mean, pretty much all month long. Depending on whatever day that you put in there you want to look at. You can look and see exactly what's going on months and months ahead. So, be sure to jump on that. Get on that. Do that. Yeah. Um... The Bad Boy Reunion Tour. The Bad Boy Reunion Tour is coming September the 8th to Phillips Arena. All right. So you haven't already, go and get your tickets because I'm fairly confident it will sell out if it hasn't already sold out. So go and grab those tickets. Get on it. Bad Boy for life. Yeah. And that's just going to be a really great experience to see all of the 90s stars of Bad Boy come together for the first time in 20 some years it's crazy y'all it is crazy so <clears throat> but it's gonna be a beautiful day crazy but beautiful crazy crazy but beautiful beautiful so we got that going on shout out to Atlanta um shout out to the Arches the Arches Atlanta alright that is this threading salon that I go to, and they do a pretty decent job. They do a pretty decent job. Uh, they make sure that my brows are on fleek, you know, and on point. And, yeah. So they take care of your girl so I can look spot on for my events this weekend, darling. Yes, darling. Yes. And we make these things happen. Point blank, period. Stick a fork in it. Yeah. So, keep pushing forward in your movement. Whatever your movement is, 
take those small steps to creating an amazing future. It's going to take work. I'm not going to sit up here and tell you, oh, well, you could just do that and then pff, life will just fall into place. No, because life is what happens when you're making plans. Life is what happens when you're making plans. That's just it. So, you got to definitely just continue to push forward no matter what. Expect change. Expect opposition. Expect negativity. Just don't absorb it. Expect it. Don't absorb it. Life will work itself out. Life will definitely work itself out. So I just say continue to push forward. Don't let anyone talk you out of your dream. Anyone to tell you that you can't do what you want to do. You try to look them in the face and say, don't believe me, just watch. Watch what I do. Watch me make it happen. Watch me make history. Right? And that's it. That's all that you got to do for that. That's it, baby babies. I love you guys so very much. Thank you for supporting me. Ashsetit.com. Info at Ashsetit.com. 800-274-4936. I love y'all so very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't say thank you enough. It is a journey, a struggle every single day. But you know what? I'm still here. I'm still doing it. And I'm going to continue to do it. All right? So... We does this. We works it out. So, I love y'all. I love you. I love you. Happy Friday. Enjoy your day. Deuces.